So we're back with Battlefield Hardline and the betas out this week for you to play right up until the 8th. And now we're thinking about vehicles. We're thinking about the speed in which you can move around the map. And Battlefield Hardline claims to be the fastest battlefield ever. Um, I'm not entirely sure I would agree with that statement considering the fact that you can move pretty quickly on a jet ski, a rib, a bike in Battlefield 4. There's a lot of stuff you can do very fast in that game. But Battlefield Hardline has done one thing very, very well. And that is it has reworked the engine models of the vehicles in the game. And I said this right back with the other beta as well. Now, every time I've played it, it's been something I've really appreciated, which is that the vehicles, the way they handle, the way they feel, the way the engines pull away, really feel like you're sort of stuck there on the ground and driving. And it's a, it's a great feeling to really pull away in those muscle cars. Even the bikes, you know, you can really thrash them around. Um, they've gone with obviously lighter vehicles than you would expect in a normal battlefield. They've dropped the Bearcat trucks, they're not going to be in there, we don't have those tanks anymore. The helicopters are quite lightweight, we don't see any jets or anything like this in the game. So it's definitely all focused on the ground and the speed on the ground, kind of need for speed sort of racing around the map. Hotwire is a game mode that you're going to be playing this week, and Hotwire really does push this idea of speed. It's a great game mode, it's a great dynamic game mode. I really love the way it plays out, actually. I have to say, um, of all the things that I've been slightly concerned about with Hardline, Hotwire actually plays out very good. You have to jump in a vehicle, and then once you've captured that vehicle, it's not like you can just park it up somewhere. You can't just stick it in a corner and wait. You've got to keep driving, because there's a little bar that loads up, which you only start capturing points for your team when you're actually driving faster around the map. So it actually is encouraging you to move around the map really quickly. This, again, you'd think, well, I'll just go to a quiet area of the map and drive round and round. It doesn't work like that. They will come and find you. They'll chase you down. Helicopters in the air, guys hunting you, sniping you. You've got to keep on the move. So it encourages this the very fluid kind of movement gameplay that, you know, you just don't see that often in some other Battlefield game modes where people can get a bit static, think a bit bogged down a bit locked down into certain positions on the map you have to be chasing those targets down capturing them recapping grabbing them moving it's a good fluid game mode and it adds something very new to actually battlefield i really enjoy it try out hotwire this week guys and see how it is a very quick game mode and it pushes your adrenaline to the max not just from actually driving the cars around but you know shooting people out of a moving car jumping in driving off stealing that from them there's a great kind of again like with blood money you can kind of cap and recap so it's not just about a fence you've got to defend that that target grab it take it back turn the game back around so again you know I'm trying to be optimistic with Hardline I'm trying to look at the positives there are some negatives as with any game release but I am you know I'm, I'm trying to be more optimistic about this I like the way that the games have played out I like a lot of the modes that they've actually put into the game uh, again the modes is something people have been fairly critical about but Hotwire as a mode it kind of does stay true to the game's ethos which is that kind of speed demon aspect you know grab the cars move fast get in fight for the objective so I'm looking forward to I'm going to see how this plays out in the beta this week. A lot more content coming up from me, guys. Stay here, Battlefield Hardline.